Hey everybody, welcome back to the Here to See channel. Got another here journal for you. Psalms chapter 122. Psalms, the book of sacred songs. The Here to See channel always focusing on sharing pearls of wisdom, nuggets of knowledge, understanding the difficult, and instructions for a better life. We're going to read through Psalms 122 and look at my here journal. Here journaling is a method that many find edifying to their relationship with the Lord. I highly suggest you try it. Check out replicate.org to learn more about here journaling. But now, let's read and listen to Psalm 122 in the New Living Translation from the YouVersion Bible app, and then my journal. Psalm 122 I was glad when they said to me, Let us go to the house of the Lord. And now here we are, standing inside your gates, O Jerusalem. Jerusalem is a well-built city. Its seamless walls cannot be breached. All the tribes of Israel, the Lord's people, make their pilgrimage here. They come to give thanks to the name of the Lord as the law requires of Israel. Here stand the thrones where judgment is given, the thrones of the dynasty of David. Pray for peace in Jerusalem. May all who love this city prosper. O Jerusalem, may there be peace within your walls and prosperity in your palaces. For the sake of my family and friends, I will say, may you have peace. For the sake of the house of the Lord our God, I will seek what is best for you, O Jerusalem. And that was Psalms chapter 122 in the New Living Translation from the Version Bible app. Now, let's read the here journal first the highlight psalm 122 verses 1 and 2 a song for pilgrims ascending to jerusalem a psalm of david verse 1 i was glad when they said to me let's go to the house of the lord and now here we are standing inside your gates O jerusalem so, what's my explanation? The psalmist said that he was glad when someone said, Let us go to the house of the Lord. There is a connection with God and with fellow believers in the house of the Lord. So, what's the application? We too can find purpose and peace in serving in the house of the Lord. How do you know you are in the right place of worship and service? Well, I would say, ask the Lord. Seek Him for His clear direction. He's called each of us to serve somewhere. We can only be at peace and contentment when we are right in the middle of God's will for our lives. Galatians 5 verses 13 and 14 says, For you have been called to live in freedom, my brothers and sisters, but don't use your freedom to satisfy your sinful nature. Instead, use your freedom to serve one another in love, for the whole law can be summed up in this one command, love your neighbor as yourself. So what's my response? Lord, thank you for making my way clear. I strive to honor and serve you and others as you have provided clear directions. I look so forward to gathering in your house, Lord, with my fellow brothers and sisters to learn, grow, and to serve you faithfully and obediently. Amen. Hallelujah. And now, how about you? Are you going to try here journaling? Give it a try. Highlight, explain, apply, respond. You'll be so glad you did. And comment below. Share your experiences with us. If you don't know Jesus as your Lord and Savior, start with John chapter 3 to learn about His plan of salvation. And talk to God about it. You can talk to God about anything. He really, truly loves you. 
keep seeking Him.